Hi guys, welcome to day 38 of my video holiday. I look horrible today. I know, I'm sorry, I've been swimming. And there was no video yesterday. Woo! So let me first explain to you why there was no video yesterday. My laptop has had some issues with its charger for a few weeks now and yesterday it decided to completely die on me. Therefore I now have to use my mum's laptop and therefore there was no video up yesterday. But I'm back today and I am going to talk to you about what I would do if I were a boy for one day. And I got this idea from a video that Jim Chapman did a while ago in which he talks about what he would do if, I, if he was a girl. And I'm going to do the guy version of that now. If I were a boy for one day, I would pee in the woods. Um, as we all know, it's a very big issue for girls. If you have to pee and you're out and about, you always have to go and find a toilet. And I would just, for once, and I know this is gross, and I know this is bad, and you shouldn't, but I would just for once like to pee in the woods. Or just to pee standing up, actually. That seems... Well, not exactly fun, but interesting to try once. If I were a boy for one day, I'd go see guy friends and see what they talk about when girls are not around. I don't know whether they talk differently when there are no girls around, because obviously I am a girl and I am around. And then they would not talk about the things that they wouldn't talk about if there were no girls around, right? Nope. Um, so I would like to see that once. Maybe it's exactly the same, because with girls, when there are no guys around, we usually talk about exactly the same things. But we might talk about the specific guys that are not around at that moment. But we also do that when there is one guy around, for example. I am kind of wondering whether guys do have actual different topics when there are no girls around. If I were a boy for one day, I would try my strength. I know that girls don't want to hear this, but biologically, guys are physically stronger than girls. And it doesn't mean that I am sexist for saying this, it is just the truth, just the raw truth, and I'm sorry. But therefore, I would want to try out my new guy strength if I was a guy for one day, because I would want to see if I actually have more strength and how much and how it feels to be stronger for one day because I am a weak little chicken. And lastly, I would eat a very meaty dish without getting weird looks. I obviously am a girl, but I like meat. I like eating meat a lot. I like eating hamburgers, steaks, beef, whatever. You name it, I'll eat it. If I like those a lot, but usually as a girl it is not really expected that you like this a lot. It's not that I get real weird looks very often, but it has happened to me before that I was in a restaurant with my vegetarian friend who happens to be a guy, and we ordered stuff. He ordered a salad because that was the only vegetarian thing on the menu. I ordered a hamburger, and when the waiter came back with our food, he still gave the hamburger to my friend and the salad to me. Because those are the things that are expected from us. And this is kind of weird. And I like meat, so I would just for once like to eat meat without getting weird looks. And especially I would like to order a whole big plate of mixed grill or something. Because I cannot usually finish that. Well, finish that. I usually don't dare to order that because I'm a girl. That was it for today, guys. I hope you liked the things that I would do if I was a guy. And I'll see you back tomorrow. Bye!